What I found to be unique about what we do is that we take the athletic kid, the talented kid, we can get them to where they need to get to baseball wise, but to be successful as a husband and as a father, you've got to work on the mind. They have to see themselves in a unique way that they are special and they have something to serve. Well, about 20 years ago when I retired from playing professional baseball at the Colorado Rockies, my sister lived here in Alpharetta, Georgia, and a couple kids in the block played baseball and they drove me into an indoor facility and that was the idea launched. And it was actually in the cage doing one-on-one -on -one lessons where I actually discovered my purpose. And I realized then that my professional baseball career was great, but the value I really brought was the fact that I struggled as a professional baseball player and I had the ability to connect with kids, having a level of empathy and seeing their pain and their struggles. So over the years, doing the one-on-one -on -one instruction, the business Alderson Baseball continued to grow. And then through that influence in our local community, travel ball baseball was growing. So what I discovered about the Georgia Jackets when I led my first team is that it wasn't necessarily always about the ability. It was about the mentality. That every kid is uniquely gifted. They are gifted. But the reality is, is that they, in their minds, don't see themselves as gifted or talented. So the battle that I realized was not really over the talent itself, was actually to get a kid to deploy their gifts on the inside of them by encouragement, through love, through grace, through discipline, through all these things, that they are greater than what the game tells them they are. So we created an environment, an exciting, influential, driving environment that they are gifted, they are unique, and through that freedom to be able to play the game, because the game's gonna tell you that you're not good enough. So through that environment, we made war with that. The environment is as good as you're going to find as far as a baseball environment, coaching environment. You just feel like they're in great hands as far as being able to continue to grow and expand their baseball experience. The program's very consistently run, teaching these kids some of the values that are important as they grow. Jeff does a great job teaching these kids how to deal with that and uh, how to grow into young men. So what we love about the Jackets is the positive environment of the coaches really put forth for these boys. It's such a great camaraderie, it's high level baseball. It's really a focus on molding them into men. The culture is so different here at Jackets with Jeff Otterson and we found a home there because my son could flourish and develop there. Georgia Jackets gives that edge for your player uh, and my son particularly um, to be ready for the next level. What we loved about it is just the culture at the Jackets and um, really great competitive baseball, but with that extra um, culture and just the coaches pouring into these boys as young men, being good sports, um, thinking about the bigger picture, and it all comes together at the Jackets in a way that I haven't seen anywhere else. I love playing for the Jackets because Coach Jeff is a is an amazing coach. He really inspires us every day, makes us better players and better people on and off the field. What I like about the Jackets is how we always pick each other up. And even when someone strikes out or makes a bad play, we're always picking each other up. That's what I like about the Jackets organization. I like playing for the Jackets because it's a great organization. There's a lot of potential on the team. And Coach Jeff, he preaches a lot of good stuff about not only baseball, but being a good person, there's lessons you can learn from baseball. So I'm very thankful. One, two, three.